Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. Today, we'll be reviewing some Jurassic World slash Jurassic Park stuff. And as you know, I love the movie Jurassic Park very much, so I'm using these Jurassic World things and other dinosaur-related items to build up my own Jurassic Park playset and world. We're going to look at each thing we got here and do some comparisons. These are just some other vehicles I have for the sake of comparison. First up on the list of Show off, we're going to look at the Imaginex Jurassic World Science Guy. He's got a big symbol for Imaginex on his back. He's got the uh, symbol for Jurassic World or Jurassic Park on his white uniform. Why not? He's pretty cool. And you can use him to access the gimmick that this playset has. You can move the ramp in and out. Kind of cool. If I do say so myself. Ramp in, ramp out. And you got to man this computer. Why not? And I say, why not? That's all there is to say for that playset. Doesn't do much. Because I don't have any other playsets to compare this to. This was a simple play set, but it's got a fenced area, got some ladders, so a guy can climb up ladders, get to the top level if he wanted to, or you can do what I'm going to probably use this top level for, land this plane from Dino Valley so it can take off and secure some dinosaurs with a net. So yeah, get some plane landing position. That's all there is to say for that plane and play set. But it's a fun play set. Next, we're going to look at these guys. From the line of Discovery, which I think they are. I, I got them holding guns, but they like to fall out of this guy's hands easily. So we got this guy and this guy, which are the exact same guys. And they're both from Discovery. And they both remind me of that one guy from the Jurassic Park movie that says, Clever girl. And they can go in these uh, tr truck right here from... Animal Planet, if you want them to. First, you get their legs like that. You put this guy down first. He's driving. This guy, second first. <sighs> Just like the first, you can put a couple of these Discovery guys in the truck and be like, let's round up some dinosaurs. Wahoo! And the truck is really fun. It's just like a Jurassic Park vehicle almost, but it says Animal Planet. But it makes noise, which makes it cool. And it says watch out for the dinosaur, so it definitely will fit with my Jurassic Park collection. And it's reversing out of there. <laughs> Ain't that fun. We gotta get out of here. 
And I'm having so much fun with this. You can put a dinosaur in the truck like they're transporting a dinosaur. This one is way too big, but it does work. Let's get out my standardized T-Rex. Put them in the Animal Planet truck. And now they're driving with a T-Rex in, in tow. But last but not least, we got this dinosaur. I don't have this particular model of dinosaur, but I do have quite the collection of dinosaurs, and I'm going to count how many dinosaurs I have in this collection for all my fans of posable dinosaurs. First, one T-Rex. Two T-Rexes. I can get this closer. Three T Rexes. One dinosaur, I don't know its name. Four dinosaurs. One Velociraptor. So that makes five dinosaurs. Two Stegosauruses. And that makes seven dinosaurs. One Spinosaurus. Making ten. Making eight dinosaurs. This dinosaur, which makes nine dinosaurs. This type of velociraptor, making ten dinosaurs. This pterodactyl, making eleven dinosaurs for our Jurassic Park collection. And finally, my final T-Rex, which makes this epic dinosaur collection up to four, from, not four, but ten, not ten, but eleven, twelve dinosaurs I own. Sorry about the correction, people. I am really getting some errors here in my head a little bit. But yeah, I own twelve dinosaurs in my Jurassic Park collection. And this is going to be a nice collection to display. And I'm so glad to have all these dinosaurs for this collection. And when I'm done with my Jurassic Park shelf, you're all going to think, oh man, that's a real awesome shelf. Probably next week, probably the week before the first of next month, we're going to give you a tour around the room as of 2022, showing off all my collections here. Well, you're probably wondering, can one of these dinosaurs fit in this trailer before I end this video? We'll show you. Boom, you can put this T-Rex in here and he can be like dragged off to the Jurassic Park facility. And this car does resemble the Jurassic Park vehicle from Jurassic Park, which is one of my favorite movies. You're probably wondering, why have I been re reviewing these things? As many of you know, I am a huge Jurassic Park fan. Always have been, always will be. Ever since I was a kid. And just because it's Easter... Here we got an Easter bunny to show off on the channel. We're going to be doing a skit with him that's going to be real funny. So stay tuned for that. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out.